Hi everybody, it's Boaz Fader and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for Saturday, April 30th, 2016. Moon in Aquarius today, fuzzy energy is in the sky. I love it. It is squaring the sun. We have to be careful uh, in our relationship between the masculine and the feminine around us and within us. There is a Queen Kong to Jupiter at around 1100 hours Central European time. That's still 5 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. It's a time, and of course, any, any of those transits, you could feel it a few hours ahead and a few hours after. So it is relevant for your morning time, America. And it's a time that we want to indulge and we want to be pampered, but it isn't always the right answer. We have to act with in we have to act in humility. We have to be more considerate and cater to people around us if we want this day to succeed for us. There's a sextile to Saturn at around 1300 hours Central European time, that's 7 a.m. <coughs> Eastern Standard Time. It's time that we feel better within the family environment, with people that are more grown up or authoritative than us. And it's it's generally a good time for work. It's a, it's a time uh, that we are more reserved and more grown up and able to carry our responsibilities better. There is a sextile to Uranus at around 1800 hours uh, Central European time, that's 1100 hours Eastern Standard Time, and a square to Vista Mercury at that, at the, at that same time. It's a great time to uh, step out of your comfort zone and try new things to uh, go unique and do the things that you love and want to explore those new territories that's a good time to do it and think outside the box and be flexible and bring innovation and renovation into your life but since this is squaring vesta mercury and mercury is retrograde just pay a lot of attention to the way you communicate today, the way you navigate through your life today. And it's all about our dedication to subjects that have a long-term effect on our life and how they fit in with our immediate craves and, and, and needs. Venus, the planet of relationship, satisfaction and uh, uh, possessions, is moving into Taurus, into her own home. Great it's great to see you here, the goddess of love, finally coming into your own home with all this erratic skies above us, again providing us with something more stable, eternal, and beautiful, and tranquil to hang on to and to recharge from. So Venus walking into Taurus, really saying that uh, this is a time that our relationships, the way we react towards money, and the way we, we need satisfaction in our life, is much more tranquil. We, I mean, we, we have a slower pace and we wait for the development of the right conditions. We don't need it right here, right now, like we did before when it was in Aries. We connect ourselves to the natural and to the classical and not so much to the new and the bold. So this, this is a very positive influence and we can reconnect to that aesthetic and the beauty and the, the, the love within nature and recharge our own batteries. Thank you for listening, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Bye-bye.